Hello and a very warm welcome to all the viewers of 3.0 TV. This is Manoj Dara. So let's do a quick check on the development in the global CBDC or the digital currency space. So India began its journey in digital currency last week by launching the e-rupee pilot project for the wholesale segment, which is primarily used by financial institutions and the international banks. Introduction of retail CBDC is expected very soon. If you talk about South Korea, after completing 10-month experiment in its digital want, has moved one step ahead. On Monday, the Bank of Korea, the country's central bank, developed a tested a program that facilitated cross-border remittance by linking different central bank digital currencies from other countries. So during the project, the bank has also tested the use of CBDC to purchase non-fungible tokens, according to some reports. So among the developed economies such as US, UK and European Union, the digital currencies are still in exploration stage. China has already carried out several trials. The European Commission will soon bring out legislation on the digital euro, said the European Central Bank President. So it was in Jan 2020, the ECB began studying the issuance of the digital euro. So during 2021, the bank, bank sought public consultation in regarding to develop a European CBDC. So last week, which is a recent development, the US Federal Reserve Bank of New York revealed that the successful completion of a test that involved the use of a CBDC for wholesale cross-border transactions, exchanges of the US digital dollar with experimenting foreign currency as a separate blockchain. So, Fed's New York branch released the result of its phase one trial of the project SEDA, a multiple study designed to help develop a technical framework for a theoretical wholesale bank digital currency network. So the project SEDA is the inaugural study being conducted by the New York Innovative Center, which is NYIC, and is intended to explore fundamental design and choices and modular technique features of a possible US CBDC. Security, speed, interoperability and ledger designs are the key focus of this research. Coming back to India, the wholesale segment which is e-rupee traded clock transactions worth 500 crores in the GSEC on Monday. Although the pace of digital remittance are slow but are well on course to accelerate. That's all there is, is in special segment of this CBDC. This is Manoj Dara signing off, but keep watching 3.0 TV for more such interesting updates. Thank you.